proving a solar naysayer wrong, and then watching them have to put their foot in their own mouth. Priceless. to another edition of Uncensored Solar TV, brought to you by all of us here at Solar Wolf Energy. So discussing the other day about how solar doesn't work, I'm sure you've seen these guys. These guys are, are fun to interact with. They're usually a, a much older generation, if you will. However, they remain and they're skeptical. I get it. They were around when Jimmy Carter tried to do everything we have right now. And the, back in the 70s and it fell on its face so they don't they don't uh, they don't buy into it I get it but converting one of these people and having them in discussion and then having them answer all the questions and then saying why don't you believe it priceless so in discussion we were just we were talking about appliances and how appliances are getting smarter they have screens on them you know, refrigerators will be able to, if they can't already, will be able to order food that you're low on and things of that nature. So I had said to an individual, I said, listen, I said, uh, they have a, a refrigerator, it's battery powered, they charge it at the factory. When you buy it, it doesn't need to be plugged in or anything, charged for a few years. And the person said, well, Jesus, that's incredible. What is, you know, what's the extra cost? I said, yeah, I, I don't think it's all that much more money. I said, um, it's not like a way of the future, right? He said, yeah. I said, um, I, I, I think it's going to catch on. I think it's going to be huge. I said, you know, if you're at, you're at Sears, you're at Walmart or wherever, you're at Lowe's or something, and you can buy a refrigerator or an exact replica of that one, just as efficient and everything else, does all the same features, and it costs you, you don't have to plug it in. It costs you nothing uh, to run it. I said, I think people are going to buy that one. I said, wouldn't you? And he said, well, yeah. I said, well, that's what solar on your roof does. Think about it. Makes sense, right? After a 25-minute conversation with the individual, they finally came around, and, and I pointed out you know, some things. I showed them an electric bill that had you know, a $6 electric bill. That was previously $190 consistently a month. Showed them a $6 bill. And after, you know, having to segue into from basically a bullshit discussion of, of refrigerators that don't need to be powered because they're better, you know, just the whole thing, right? Just bringing it from there and then showing them was finally able to, to bring one of these uh, naysayers. You know these people, they go on social media pages and say, Solar's a scam! When you can finally break it down to these folks and show them that there is value in what we're doing in this industry, there is value in what we're doing going forward, and the people we care about are going to benefit the most, our children, then it's, it's, it's quite uh, it's that satisfying, right, to say the least. So. I just wanted to share with you guys that, that, that short exchange I had with somebody and that story, I think it's pretty funny. I think it's um I think it deserves merit because it's it's real. It's a real problem we have in this industry that bringing people over to our side to believe what we do is legit. Thanks for watching the episode of Uncensored Solar TV, brought to you by all of us here at Solar Wolf Energy. Thanks.